welcome to another episode of Kya Pushpa. Wondering what is buzzing in the halls of Dormaso College this week? It's a much awaited fun week 2023. From August 21st to 24th, our college was set up to be a whirlwind of creativity, style and excitement. So let's dive in and explore the fantastic highlights. The first day of the fun week had the OTT theme in which students had to showcase their favorite web series characters that brought out the inner you. Our students embraced their inner web series heroes. They became the characters who brought out the rebel, the romantic, the dreamer within them. The students were assigned with dressing up as iconic characters. The department of BBA TNT and BA prepared delicious snacks for the fun week canteen. On the second day, our students embarked on a fashion journey like never before. It was a fusion of style where East met West and tradition danced with modernity. It challenged the creativity to its finest. The students from BCA and BPI departments set up a food stall that was nothing short of heaven. The grand finale, the 24th of August, the campus transformed into a regal palace. Students arrived dressed in their finest formals, exhibiting an air of elegance and sophistication. It was a day to feel like royalty. It was the day when the students transformed into kings and queens and thanks to our Department of Mass Communication for managing the canteen. Our students took royal entries in their shiny attires. It wouldn't be wrong if we mistook our campus to be a palace witnessing the royal presence that day. To teach us about the precautions to be taken while reporting as a journalist and the safety aspects of live reporting, we had a session by Mr. Prakash Kamath, a senior journalist who is passionate about imparting his wisdom to the newer generation. The Department of Social Work, along with the District Tobacco Control Cell, organized a session to raise awareness about tobacco health hazards. The students were taught about the ill effects of tobacco and the resources available for quitting it. On 20th August, on the occasion of National Sports Day, the Department of Physical Education conducted an inter-class football tournament. After thrillingly playing the whole day, the boys of SYB Pet emerged victorious and the girls of FYB Pet won the trophy. events at Don Bosco College. Is there anything left now? It seems like a never-ending saga. Obviously, it is Don Bosco College. Here, each event is like no other. And this week was even more fun because we had synthesis. Yes, synthesis. Don Bosco College's interclass event, whose theme this year was cruising through cultures. This time, each class represented a country and its vibrant culture. Ms. Asai Rajthun, the proprietor of Wakao Foods, had the honor of serving as chief guest and officially inaugurating Synthesis. Synthesis was fueled by the culinary prowess of House of Hyderabad Biryani and Amigos, making it a delectable and harmonious blend of cultural celebration. Synthesis at Don Bosco College was a blast. It spent two days of fun activities like dance, singing competition, treasure hunt, creative fashion show, and intense sports like Throughball. The event celebrated diversity and unity. 
making it a memorable experience for everyone. The second runners up of synthesis 2023 were Team Kenya, that is SYBBA TNT. The runners up of synthesis 2023 were Team Egypt, that is FYTPAD. And the winners of synthesis 2023 were declared to be Team Portugal, that is students of SYBNC. We hope you enjoyed this episode. This is me Ramesh and me Sharvi signing off from Campus Notes.